in the heart of the Turkana Desert. This school welcomes young students from across the region for courses in digital technology. There are some artificial intelligence software that would edit some music. Quality hardware and stable internet connection are hard to come by in the remote county. Since the school opened in 2020, over 680 people have attended classes here. Having built up a, a campus like this that offers um, these chances to do IT stuff and design, it's something really nice that this campus has done. And the other thing that I like about it is we don't get to study for that long. They only give us the, the skills that are very important at the moment and they help us um, explore the market. Website creation, photography, design, the training lasts for about one year. After a first taster workshop, students can then choose a specialty. This level ideally prepares them for the real world jobs. And so after here we expect that uh, with many programs that we, uh, partners that come along, they would probably be working in different fields. And uh, we also train them uh, in this case so that they can be freelancers. All trainees are hosted on campus, which is still under construction. Brian gives us a tour of his somewhat peculiar accommodation. Then you can be sleeping outside, yet you are still inside the bedroom. When there is cold, you come inside. Everything here was designed to survive the heat. The mastermind behind the buildings is Francis Kiri, a world-famous architect from Burkina Faso and winner of the Pritzker Prize. We shared with him our vision and he visited here and he experienced the heat. He experienced the wind directions. He experienced the directions of the sun. And so he went, combined all those things and combining all those, he gave us this amazing building. This famous name is attracting investors. Soon, additional buildings will increase the school's capacity to a total of 250 students.